Hi, I'm Steve from Honest Pigum, and this is Mark, and we're here today to talk to you about the new Blizzard Brahma 88. So, it might look the same, it's got the same name, but there has been some updates, and they're actually really important updates, and it feels different. So to talk you through that, here's Andy from Blizzard. Hi, I'm Andy from Blizzard. I'm here to show you uh, the new Brahma 88 for the fall winter 2021 season. Uh, this year it's a whole new ski with the new wood core, the True Blend wood core, um, which gives the ski a completely new feel, new characteristics. Also has a new side cut, uh, comes in different lengths as well this year, uh, but still maintaining 88 mil underfoot, which makes it a really versatile width underfoot. The True Blend wood core is basically uh, made up of different stringers, wooden stringers that are different densities that go across the ski, but also throughout the length of the ski as well, to make sure you've got the right amount of wood uh, throughout the ski to make it as smooth as possible when you're skiing. Uh, the ski's uh, pretty most suited to an advanced to expert level skiers because it's got a forward core, two layers of two and a half layers of titanol through the ski. Uh, but with the wood core technology makes it really accessible because it allows the ski to flex where it needs to uh, to make it easy when you're doing short turns or longer turns and also super powerful when you're going through the crud as well for off-piste. First thing I want to tell you is that it's our overall men's ski of the year. It wins the all-mountain category as well, but it is the overall winner, and it was a fairly easy choice. So our first shortlist for this, for the, the winner of the overall ski, didn't include a Brahma on it, because we figured same ski, only a, what seemed to be a small tweak to it, maybe wouldn't make a big difference, but actually it made a huge difference. Um, and after just one run, we pretty much knew it was going to be right there in the top of the list. So uh, we skied it in Glensheet, we had every condition going. Um, we had fresh snow, we had tracked out snow, we had hard snow. Um, perfect for trying to ski like this. So Mark, what did you reckon? So for me, if I was going to go away for a week skiing and I didn't know what the conditions were going to be like, this would be at the top of my list. Um, 88 mil underneath the foot. So it's wide enough if I want to go and play and stuff in some of the deeper stuff. Uh, there's got float to it, but it's still maneuverable. Um, construction wise, you, you think it's going to be a really powerful ski and it is, but actually I think having a, that flip core in it helps just to kind of almost kind of tone it down a bit and make it a lot more usable at slower speeds as well. Yeah, um, I think that true when it does soften the tip and tail a little bit, but for all you Brahma fans, don't worry, it's got all the power and grip that the old one had, but it's just a bit easier. Just the time, the thing that really made it stand out for me was um, I wasn't skiing in the freshest of snow. It was all tracked out, so it was bumpy, it was lumpy, and usually I just have the brakes on a little bit and I'd maybe just be watching my turns a touch. But I skied this through that and it felt like I was skiing fresh snow. I wasn't bothered at all what was in front of me. I was full gas, super smooth, really stable. Um, and I'd echo what Mark said, I think this would be number one on my list as a the ski to take if I didn't know where I was going or what I was going to get. I know I'd be happy on piste, I know I'd be happy in powder, and probably, for me, best choice for variable snow as well. So, um, if you want any more information on that ski, check out the web pages. Uh, we've got loads more info there. Um, or you call into one of the stores or give us a ring and we'll let you know a bit more. Otherwise, if you have any questions or any comments, if you've skied it, pop them below, we'll come back to you. So thanks for watching.